Hey guys, so today I'm going to do a little get ready with me for festivals. Barry M have just bought out some incredible new products that are super easy to use, super affordable and I'm going to show you exactly how I will wear them. I'm going to start off showing you exactly how I'm going to do my eye makeup. My base is already applied so stay with me and see exactly what I do. So for me, I like to keep my lips quite nude for festivals and go really extreme on the eyes and make them really pop and stand out. I'm going to go in with the Fall In Love palette, which literally I have fallen in love with this year. It's, it's incredible. Like the pigments are so beautiful and the colours are so wearable, but also give that quite like vivid, dramatic look if you want to go down that route. But I'm going to stick to, hmm, I'm going to go for these four shades here. So you've got the yellow there, you've got that beautiful almost like a reddish tone and then you've got the warm browns here as well. So the first one I'm going to apply is that beautiful mustard shade and I'm going to apply that just across the eyelid. I like to make things super easy, super quick because you know we're all in a rush sometimes. It's nice to have our makeup done effectively but also in a quick way. So you can see I've literally just applied that and I'm using a blending brush and going back and forth just blending it all out instantly makes the green pop out. I'm going to go in with the same colour but just a slightly more angled brush and then I go under the lash line. Now I've got that gorgeous mustard tone all over, I'm just blending it all out. So now I'm going to add that beautiful red shade just on top of that, just close to the lash line. With that same shade I'm just bringing it under the lash line slightly above that warm yellow. I'm now going to mix these two warm brown shades here and I'm going to bring that just slightly out and smoke it out a little bit more. I'm using that blending brush from earlier, I don't want it to be like a harsh line. I just want to smoke it out. You can add lashes, I've already got mine, I've got the individual semi-permanent ones in but I always had like a really beautiful strip lash. Or oh, lots of mascara Okay, so I'm really happy with my eyes. I'm now going to use the Crush Jewel in Duvet Day and I'm going to apply it to the inner corners of my eyes just to make them really pop and stand out. See, I'm just applying a little bit, dabbing it in. So I'm going to line my waterline with this incredible product which I'm absolutely obsessed with. They do so many different colours now and I'm going to use the brown. It's waterproof, it does not budge, it is literally the best eyeliners I've probably ever used. They don't budge, I mean you get so much more for your money when they do not budge. Okay, so I'm going to use the brown. So I've completed the eyeshadow, I'm now just going to apply a generous coat of this beautiful showgirl mascara to my bottom lashes. Barium have launched these incredible face jewels. They're super easy, super long wearing, and so easy to use. It literally shows you where to put it. You peel it off, and then you apply it just to those areas. I mean, I'm going to use Arabian Nights because how stunning is that? So I'm following where the diagram said to put it. So I put these two little ones just under my eyes, and now I'm going to add the one across my forehead. So these ones are the ones that go above your eyebrow. Stunning, does that look already? So I've now applied the ones just above my eyebrow and i just got to do the one down my forehead. So I'm going to apply that gem just straight down the middle of my forehead. Make sure it all looks even, matched up and then really pat it down like so. Now I know I look a bit jeweled up but we need some glitter. So now I'm going to go in with the glitter and the best way to apply it is with the glitter fixer gel. This stuff does not budge and when I mean it doesn't budge, you'll really have to really kind of work to get it off. It's that long lasting, it's amazing. So what you do is a gel formula. I always like to apply a little bit to the back of my hand, you only need a little bit as well. Dab that gel onto the areas that you're going to apply it and then press the glitter in. So I'm going to add a little bit of that gel, can you see where I blended out that eyeshadow? I'm going to dab a little bit here, so I want a small amount of glitter to go there. 
And I'm going to use the incredible Glitter Rush Pots and I'm going with the shade Fireball. It's a gorgeous golden tone. And you can see, it gets a little bit of excess in the lid, that's what I tend to like to use. It's a shaker pot, so just shake it back and forth. And with my ring finger, I'm just going to dab a little bit just here. I don't want too much around my eyes because I've already accentuated it quite a bit with the jewels. So I'm actually just going to go and just shake it and just kind of smother it over. I'm going to go all out with this glitter. You really can't go wrong if you've got too much glitter. Look at that. Oh, wow. You can see that glitter fixer gel is just incredible. So this is like the base because I'm going to add some more glitter but I want to go for slightly bigger chunks. So you can see, oh that looks incredible, oh I love it. So Barium have brought out these incredible stackable glitter pots. They do four different shades, I'm going to use the shade Lit because it kind of matches into what I'm using and also the shade Slay because as you can see it's got these little turquoise gems there so I want to match it all up. You can see, wow it looks amazing. So there you have it guys, this is my festival inspired look using my favourite barium glitzy products that are going to be perfect for these festivals.